G'day guys, doing some bait fishing in the Campaspe River at Aysen's Reserve this evening. There's only about two hours of light left, so I better hurry up and get my baits in the river. Now I've picked this spot in particular this evening, Aysen's Reserve, because the river's still very high with a lot of current in some sections following the flooding event we had in the Campaspe River last week. And the river here is backed up by the Elmore Weir at Aysen's Reserve, so it's nice and, nice and wide and there's not too much current to deal with. Now I'm using my usual running sinker rig with a couple of Janjuck worms on each hook. Janjuck worms down there. And I'm not going to cast out very far at all. I think I'll put this one on a bit of an angle out that way. And this one on a bit of an angle out that way. That'll do. One thing I did forget this evening was my landing net. Well, I didn't forget it. I remembered to grab it, but it's sitting next to the front door at home. <laughs> so the good old lip grips are going to have to make do and hopefully I can reach the water. Maybe over there there's a bit of a step I can use to get down to the fish. Just got a tap on the white rod. First bit of action. Been here about five minutes, so that's not too bad was very small. I'm hoping it was a fish bite, but I'll pick it up just in case. <clears throat> it seemed to be a bit more fishy than the other tap I had. See if he wants to come back. Oh, he did come back too, but I missed. Bugger, that was a good bite too. Nearly stole all my worms. Uh, I might re-thread that one little half a Janjuck worm and get it back out there to see if he's still hanging around because I didn't feel any weight when I struck. He's back messing with me again. I was just shooing a very persistent mosquito when he bit so I'm not sure if I got the angle right if I captured the nibble on camera or not but there's something playing with the bait again. I just lost my rig to a snag on the white rod so I threw out the black rod in its stead because it's the one getting bites I was gonna say while I re-rig the white rod this one will hopefully catch me a fish but then before I could even finish my sentence I got a bite on it something tricky out there if I had to guess what can do that to a worm in half a second, I'd say it's a silver perch messing with me. Haven't caught one in a while actually, I wouldn't mind seeing a silver perch, but I've got to hook the bugger first. Oh, let's see what I can do here. This one's just out there messing with me, so I'm just going to cast it out and hang on to it. Got him. Whatever it is, I've got him. Hanging on to the rod paid off. I think I've called it. No, it's a red fin. Not a bad ready either. Not a bad red fin. If I had an esky with me, I'd probably keep him and get some fillets off him. He's about 23 centimetres. Are you the worm thief, mate? I don't know, but you're fun. And you're my first fish on the board. I so I haven't even rigged that rod yet. <laughs> I might just stick with the one rod if there's a school of you guys out there. Anyway, I don't like killing anything I'm not going to keep. And by law, I'm allowed to put him back where I caught him from. So, see you later, Redfin. Might just stick with a single Janjuck worm. Fills the hook pretty well anyway. And I think I'll stick with a single rod as well. There's no point re-rigging that one. It wasn't getting any bites. And this one's getting hit as soon as it hits the bottom. So I think I might just cast it out and hold on to it. He's back. Cheeky bugger. I held the rod for about 10 minutes and didn't get a touch, so I put it down and I've half rigged that rod again, thinking it's gone quiet, and now he's come back while I was busy. <laughs> as soon as it hit the bottom, just put a fresh worm on it to see if that would make a difference. And they're back almost instantly. Oh, I missed though. Cheeky buggers. <laughs> they stole one of my two worms, so I'm going to give them a fresh Janjuck worm. 
to accompany the one that's still on there but as you can probably tell the sun's setting over there so I've only got about 15 minutes of light left a last ditch effort to get a second fish here we go they're back tiny nibbles hopefully another decent red fin but I'm happy just to catch anything just let me get a second fish on the board and I'll be very happy well there's the snag that snapped me off on the white rod earlier and I think that's a sign the sun's disappearing over there behind the horizon and that is another lost rig and I might have to call it there the footage is hard to get at the moment between the school holidays and the floods that came through and the wind well it's given us a break today but it usually hasn't been leaving us alone the footage has been hard to get but I've got a fish today I'll make that a video just to let you know I'm still trying I'm still out there drowning on the worms giving it a red hot crack hopefully I'll have a more exciting video coming for you soon thanks guys see you later